Hey guys, it is thrifting time. I've got another haul today from a different store. This one's called Deseret Industries and it's pretty amazing. Their prices are always good. I don't think I've ever been there when there's a sale, but they don't need a sale. I think the most I've ever paid for an item there is $8. So yeah, let's get to it. So I usually find a wide variety of great things. They have tons of jeans there. Uh, pretty, pretty good active wear section as well. I found these cool little, um, these are Lucky Brand and they're like a pencil uh, cropped jean. So they're really cute. Um, these were $8. And a little bit of stretch and the wash is amazing. So these are going to be really great with heels. Good for the, the summer and the spring. So yeah. Uh, these are awesome. Uh, these are from The Gap. And they're, I, I've never seen these. I mean, I'm sure they've been around, but these are like moto khakis, which, okay, that's cool. So they're the same materials like your, you know, your traditional khaki pants, but they've got the whole moto detailing, which is awesome. They have a little zipper in the ankle because these are all, these are skinny pants too, so they call them the skinny mini khakis. Um, so a nice spin on the traditional khakis, and these were $6. I mentioned this before, but I'm always on the lookout for active wear because it's always very expensive. Um, so I never go to a thrift store without going through the active wear section. I found this shirt that looks basically new. It's really cool. It's Mountain Hardware, which is you know normally pretty pricey, but it's a good brand. Uh, we got really nice long sleeves, which I appreciate. It's got a hood. It's a little bit thinner, definitely good. You know if you're jogging, or um, you know I might. I mean. It's hard for me wearing shirts with hoods uh, when I do yoga, but I would definitely wear this a lot just out and about. And this was $3. Another cool jacket. I always look for like light little jackets because sometimes I have to layer. Like, you know, it might be chillier in the morning and then get warmer throughout the day, so I like layers. This is a really good quality Columbia. It's their titanium line. And um, it's, you know, kind of a stretchy athletic jacket. It's not a fleece. I would say it's more on the, like, maybe like running wear type. I'm trying to see what it's made of. It's got fleece lining. I think this is a really good just out and about jacket. It uh, has some zipper detail and it's in really good condition. I, I swear, it looks like it's never been worn or maybe even worn a little bit, which is nice because the inside is a little more worn looking, but the outside you would never know. And I don't really care about the inside because no one's going to see that. <laughs> and this was $5. And I always am looking out for basics. Um, I don't like spending $20 on a plain white t-shirt, so if I can find decent, you know, white t-shirts at the thrift store, I'm going to get them. Uh, this one is, it's, it's a little bit longer, I really like the styling and the cut. I love this. I always check the armpits when I'm doing uh, whites because that's where they show the most evidence of wear. This one looks fine and it was two dollars. Another cute t-shirt. Sometimes I don't have the energy to look through all the t-shirts. I, I, I mean I like t-shirts but usually at thrift stores there are so many I will just kind of peruse and if something catches my eye then I'll look closer. Uh, Deseret Industries does a really nice they display their things differently so they have lots of little clusters of the round racks so they have different items displayed 
in small little chunks. So if you see something, you can just quickly look in that little group and then move on to a larger rack of, say, shirts. So it's easier to find items that might be unique because they feature those and they have those, you know, toward the front. Anyway, this shirt is really cute. It's a fox with some earrings and it's got a flower in its mouth. I don't know. Um, you probably know by now that I love animals and I love foxes, so I couldn't pass this up. Anyway, this was $2. And the last item is, I know I talked about this last time that I'm all about large oversized sweaters. I can't get enough of them. So this one is so awesome. It's a cardigan. Yeah. Love it. Nice and thick. And it was $8. Uh, it's from a brand Kirsch. And yeah, it's, you know, gray. Got a little bit of white and tiny little bit of black detailing. So this is going to go with everything. That wraps it up for the Deseret Industries haul. Let me know what you guys think about the items I found. And I'll see you guys next time.